What is good, you too? It's your it's boy, your boy babe. Babe. And I got an exotic bounty that I've been working on for a couple of days now called a dubious task. The first part is you go, you talk to the warlock vanguard, and then after you speak with her, you go to part two. Part two has to basically deal with you going into Crucible and obtaining 25 kills. Uh, if you're not a really good Crucible player, this might be um, a bit of a challenge for you, but you know, just stick with it. I suggest either going for heavy ammo when it comes up, going with the LMG, trying to get as many kills as you want to. Part three has to do with doing a weekly challenge. And the weekly challenge can either be nightfall or just a regular weekly challenge. You can put it on about 22 and maybe grab a friend or two and get through it really quickly. Um, and the only reason why I'm not showing this footage is because, you know, it would be useless. The video would be about an hour long. So showing that footage would, you know, really be no purpose. Part four of the dubious task is to uh, buy up 50 special ammo and once you buy up the 50 uh, as I skipped a little bit ahead then you're able to buy the gun that the gunsmith is offering you uh, because of the warlock vanguard um, I guess some deal that they had so once I did that and I bought it then I'm able to obtain the shotgun then I take the shotgun back to the warlock vanguard and then from there you basically have the gun before I do that, I'm going to go to the Postmaster pick up this Crytek pack because uh, I leveled up. And as you can see, I have two legendary engrams. And I end up getting an exotic chest armor out of one of them. So I'm going to take the shotgun back to the Warlock Vanguard. And then from here, I'm able to obtain it. As you can see. Uh, exotic shotgun, invective, damage is 260, possible damage is 300, as long as you rank it up to the fullest. It's definitely a strong shotgun. I've used it a couple of times when I had to go up close with certain enemies on certain parts. Uh, I would prefer a legendary auto rifle, still working on that. I have more videos coming out, some about how to do bounties as quickly as possible. I have a video coming out soon about that. Uh, just covering certain bounties and uh, how to really link them together so you're not really wasting time doing multiple bounties at one time. You know, flying from one planet to the next. If you make sure that you can knock out two to three bounties on one planet, then it saves you more time. Uh, if you figure out, you know, which places spawn certain ultras or majors, whether it's Fallen or Hive or Cabal, and you're able to get through certain stuff a little bit quicker. Now, if this video has helped you out in any type of way, definitely hit that like button for more videos. Subscribe, subscribe to your, to your boy, boy babe. babe. And I'll see you on the next video.